Welcome to the Drupal Academy. In the last video, we have seen the introduction of waveform module in a Drupal and some its features. In this video, I will show you how to install the waveform module in a Drupal. So for that, go to the google.com and search for the waveform module in a Drupal 10. After that, go to this URL on the drupal.org that is the web forms models url using the web form models here we can see the screenshot we can develop the simple as well as multi-step complex forms so scroll to the bottom and after that click on this latest version of this model if you have the composer setup you can just copy this command composer require Drupal slash webform copy this and paste it here in your root directory of a project and if you want to download manually just click on this latest version and click here to download the zip file of this model so for this demo purpose I have already downloaded this uh, webform model zip and extracted it in my projects models folder now go to back to your website in the admin panel go to the extends after that search for the web form module so here you can see it has downloaded the multiple packages of web form module that is web form demo web form example web form deprecated but right now we will just install the models from this web form only so first is the web form so it will enable the creation of web form and uh, question eyes if you want to create any question eyes web form access it provides the access control for the web form nodes then the next is the web form attachment it provides an element that generates or loads a file that can attach to submission or email web form bootstrap provides the if you want to create the form as a responsive then again the web form cards web form client side validation if you want to add the validations next is the web form custom options so there are multiple modules provided by the web forms but for this demo purpose we will just install the web form web form access web form bootstrap next is uh, web form node web form image select next is the web form option limit web form templates web form submission logs and the web form ui so this will this model will provide the user interface for building and maintaining the web forms after that click on this install button to install the model and if you are facing the timeout issue so it's a good practice to install these modules one by one so click on this install and just wait for the installation here we can see that the webform module is installed successfully now go to the structure to access the webform module just scroll to bottom and you can see the web form models link is added in the structure menu click on this web forms from this page we can create our custom forms using the web forms in the next video i will show you how to create the form using the web form in a drupal 10 so that's it from this video I hope this video is useful for you. If you have any query or suggestion, please write it in the comments below. Thank you for watching and see you in the next video.